awesome good evening to everybody once more this is gccmi online bible club and you are welcome you are welcome all right today um our topic today is okay open to your bible lesson booklet if you have it to pages 57 if you have the first edition page 57 if you have the second edition page 55 i want you to read out the topic that we have today Who's there? All right, Tiwa. Yes, I'm with you. Oh, beautiful. Forgiveness. That's our topic today. That's our topic today. So, all right, let's read a little bit about what we have here. All right. I hope, how many of us have our Bible lesson manuals? Let me see. Let me see. Awesome. Beautiful. 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 Wonderful. All right. Let's get into it right away. All right. So, I'm reading now, so we have to look into our Bible lesson booklets. And if you don't have it, just listen up, you'll get it all the same. All right, so I read there are many verses in the Bible that talk about forgiveness, but we will only take a few of them. I said there are many verses, yes, and that is true. There are many verses that talk about um, forgiveness in the Bible, but today, because of time, we can only take a few. A few of them now the Bible talks a lot about forgiveness somebody's mic is on I want to mute somebody sorry all right okay so the Bible talks a lot about forgiveness maybe because it's one of the values of our Christian faith because the Bible talks a lot about forgiveness and that's because possibly it's because it is one of the values in our Christian faith we have a lot of values in our Christian faith. We have honesty, we have forgiveness, we have love, we have peace. And when I mean what I mean Christian faith and values, what um these are the things that we as Christians, when they see us, the way we act, the way we behave, they will know that yes, mm, this girl is a child of God, this boy is a child of God, this preteen is a child of God. This man is a child of God. This woman is a child of God. What just just by behaving the way you're just behaving, you you've not sat them down and say, "Let me tell you about Jesus. Let me tell you about uh, the Holy Spirit. Let me tell you about God." You've not done that. Too. Just by behaving the way you are behaving, behaving well, you are at peace with everybody. You don't fight. People are fighting. You 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 want to hey you guys don't fight. You want to settle the case. You want to settle it, or you know they left you in a room and. When you are there, something gets missing, and they just know it can't be. It can't be Tiffany. It can't be Treasure. It can't be Chidera that took that money. It can't be. It can't be Giovanni. It can't be Sarah. It can't be Ruth. It can't be Tiwa or Pelumi or Imano. No, they are not the ones that took. It must be somebody else because of the way you you behave. Hmm? When they say do this, you obey in school, at home, in church, in your neighborhood. Everything they do. Those, these are values. These are values in our Christian faith. Mm? These are values. These are the things that we, we do and people see us and say, mm, that is a child of God. This is a child of God. Yes. Those are the things that happen. That's, that's what they're talking about there. Now, forgiveness, I, I read, I'm, 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 I'm reading. Forgiveness is letting go. Okay, before I say that, what is forgiveness? Who can tell me? By your, um, from your understanding, what do you... What do you think forgiveness is? What do you think forgiveness is? Um, treasure, hold that thought. Dara, yes, can I hear you? Hey, who's that? To Toby or to and Toba, you, you wait your turn, please. If I don't call you, please don't speak. Thank you. All right, Dara, yes, can I hear you? Hmm? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. I like that your definition. Yes. Uh, Perculia. I wish you had your camera on, but Perculia, treasure, hold that thought. Perculia, can I hear from you? I can see your hand up. Is Perculia there? 
all right yes oh, why are you fiddling with the mute button okay peculiar let me hear you what is forgiveness all right okay peculiar is in the aura can i hear from you yes what is forgiveness i see your hand up you want to try give it a try okay what is forgiveness all right okay 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 beautiful wow wow lovely lovely i love that definition i love that definition that was that was awesome that was awesome treasure you wanted to say something yes beautiful all beautiful answers thank you guys so much i am learning here i am learning here all right so i read on now um from our uh, booklet forgiveness is letting go of any wrong that anyone has done to you directly or indirectly forgiveness is letting go of any wrong any you know thing that's made you sad that anyone has done to you directly or indirectly now if i can explain the directly or indirect indirect um line there it means um do you know that some people when you hurt their brother they they get okay let's say um you know someone hurt my sister now you know it's my sister the person hurts then I start getting angry at the person. I am now angry at the person. I'm like, why, why did you hurt my sister? Why did you? And maybe the person has already said, I'm sorry, it was an accident, but I now I'm getting angry. Now that's where it's not direct. What was done was direct to my sister or brother, but it wasn't done to me, but I was angry anyway. So it's also possible that way. Somebody can do something to another person and then you'll be angry. So that's the indirect way. I read on. Let's look into our booklets, please. Now, this means that we do not keep a score or we do not keep score or account of how many times someone wronged us. We do not keep score. Some people have, I know when I was growing up, when I was growing up, I had a friend that had a, uh, a diary and whatever happened to her, whether good or bad, she would journal it there. She would, she would write it down. But would I call it a diary or a journal? So she was journaling all these things, bad or good. There's one day, you know, I spoke to her and I said, this thing you're doing, it's not good. You're not supposed to, you know, keep, keep these things, um, keep writing these things. Because sometimes you will read them, you might go back to read them and all the emotions all the anger all the sadness that you know you experienced when it happened everything comes back again and then you get angry again and that's not the way to live that's not, that's not the right way to go so i spoke to her and then she stopped so um there are some people they, they do that they keep score or you hear someone say that's how you did the other day you 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 broke my pencil now today you you, you turn my book why why did you do that I, I, i'll report you i'm not i'm not your friend again i'm not no 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 you don't do that that is when you are keeping score you are keeping score you're counting yes that time and eh, the other day and eh, or last week and eh, last month and eh, you did this the other day and then you did it again again and again now you're doing it again and then you 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 go on and on and on like that that's that's not the way to live that's not the way a child of god should live all right so we are to keep no records no records when you when you're forgiving someone 
you don't. That's what it means. It means that we do not keep, I'm reading here. It, this means that we do not keep score or account of how many times someone wronged us. Now, we must learn to forgive others, whether they apologize to us or not. Whoa, that is huge. Did we hear that? If you heard that, let me see your head. I want you to nod your head if you heard that. I just read that we should forgive, we should learn to forgive others. We should learn to forgive others, whether they apologize to us or not, because Jesus also forgives all our trespasses. So it is important we forgive others so that God can forgive us. Hmm. Somebody say, hmm. <laughs> hmm. Because, because I know, you know, I know that, um, I know that it is, um, if someone wronged you, I hope we understand the meaning of when someone wrongs you, when someone does something bad to you. If you understand, can I see your head? Nod your head. If you do understand it. All right. Beautiful. Awesome. When when someone wronged you, it, 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 it's um, easy if the person comes back and says, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know. I mean, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I, I won't do it again. And, and the person comes and then you guys shake on it and then everybody goes their way. It's easy to forgive. What if the person, <laughs> the person, you talk, you went as far as even telling the person, hey, brother, sister, you hurt me, you broke my pencil for crying out loud, you broke my pencil, and the person say, says, uh huh, it's not just a pencil. What what what's, what are you why are you making a fuss over it? Please excuse me, and the person turns back. <gasps> How many of us can forgive that kind of person? Me. <laughs> I want to hear from you. Is it easy to forgive someone that doesn't apologize? I want to hear from you. Yes, I want to hear your voices. I want to hear you. I want to hear from you. Yeah. All right, Queen. You want to say something, or it's a thumbs down? <laughs> yes, Ruth. Okay, wait, wait. Hold on, you guys. Hold on. I'm gonna take everybody. Ruth. Yes, can I hear from you? <laughs> Yeah, it's it's hard. It's hard. Yes. Thank you for being very honest. Thank you. Yes, who else wants to add to that? I saw some hands raised up. Um Queen. Queen Blessing was giving me a thumbs down, so she doesn't uh, she doesn't think she can um forgive someone that wrongs her and doesn't apologize and is even rude. You know? Tiwa Tiwa Pelumi, yes. You wanna say something? <laughs> oh my oh my oh my whoa okay 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 Tiwa yes okay okay yes <laughs> yes that is correct that that is true okay okay who else wants to add to that sarah you're awfully quiet this evening how are you i hope you're listening to us i hope you're learning something okay so i want to ask you would you Forgive someone who doesn't come to apologize to you, who is rude and doesn't apologize. Would you? <laughs> okay, thank you all for being very, 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 very truthful. I understand you. I understand you. You know, yes, all right, you want to say something?
You will not forgive them, right? Okay. <laughs> okay. Long, yeah. Okay. Okay, that's good. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. Chidera and Chidera will be the last, and I will continue. Chidera, yeah. What do you, What do you think? What, what can you Can you forgive? Thank you so much. Or me, uh, or me, 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 mommy, mommy, mommy. We forgive our parents, mommy, mommy. We can forgive people who are arrogant and not. Okay, okay. Alright, thank you for being truthful. Yes. Okay, you know what? We are going to read some Bible verses. We are going to read some Bible chapters and I mean some Bible verses, some scripture, and then we'll see what God wants us to do in these kind of cases. In these kind of cases. Alright. So um the first scripture is Matthew chapter six, verse fourteen. Matthew chapter six, verse fourteen. If you are with your Bible, please turn it with me. All right, please, can you read? All right, yes. All right, go ahead, go ahead. Okay. Oh, beautiful, wonderful. So, if you forgive men their trespasses, your Heavenly Father will also forgive you. Alright, so, I want to ask a question. <laughs> Can you name... <laughs> Hello? Okay, guys. Can you name a sister or a brother or a friend that, that constantly bothers you? Can somebody give us a name? <laughs> Chidera, who are you looking at like that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, wait, so, um, um, Toby. Toby, who, 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 who is Toby? Yes? Oh, sorry about that, Toba. All right. Hello, you said? Dovedas is the name of the person, right? Mm. Dovedas, awesome. Okay, so how? Okay, all right, all right. So everybody has a name of someone that really bothers them a lot. Whether in school, who is that? All right. So everybody has a name. I mean, I'm. Someone is. Hey, hey, hey! Blessing, would you um mute yourself, please? <clears throat> all right. Now. I just said, you know, give me a name. Can you name it something? Okay, no, I mean, okay. What about now? Uh, what's the name of the person? Double, double dash, right? What does what does the person do? What does the person do that 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 bothers you? The person. Do... Are you for real? Really? Wow, that's not nice. That's not nice. So, what we just read now from the Bible that says, if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly father will also forgive you. Now, the Bible doesn't say, if you forgive men their trespasses, when they apologize. Does it say that? I want everybody to nod their head or if you are in agreement, does it say... Okay, let's say if you forgive men their trespasses when they are nice to you or when they apologize or when they are they are kind or when they give you biscuit and sweets after they are rude to you. Did it does it say that? No. It doesn't say that. Now the Bible is saying you should forgive men their trespasses and your heavenly father will also forgive you so how many times are we supposed to forgive someone a lot every time every time i know it's not good someone calling you names in school and it bothers you you know but 
you tried have you tried talking to him and telling him hey hey guy um, i don't like this i would really appreciate it if you stop have you tried talking to him and he still persists okay okay sometimes you could also pray about it hmm? you could also pray about it and then maybe go as far as telling your teacher in school i know they might call you a tattle tail okay that's good and then since you've gone you've you've you've, you've told the teacher about it, you can pray about it just tell god that god i, I really don't like uh, you know donovan uh, calling me names but can you help me do something about it sweet holy spirit i don't like it and it bothers me and i know you wouldn't like these kind of things to bother me because i'm your child so please help me attend to it hmm? you can also say that prayer it's not it's not um it's not hard you know so yeah and you know you have to the bible tells us clearly it's clear here that we are to forgive others many times just as god does for us you know do you know how many times you sin i'm sure some of you will say you don't sin but there are some things that you do that I'm sure God does, doesn't like. And it's not, you don't have to maybe carry a gun. <laughs> well, you can just go to the pantry and just take a cookie without telling anybody. Or mommy tells you, can you help me do this? I'm like, oh, I don't want to do that. Now. I want to watch TV now. I want to play my game now. I mean, that's, don't you think that would make mommy not happy? No. There are things that we do. A lot of things. Toba, yes. Toba. Who is Toba, mommy? <laughs> okay. Are are you older than your brother? Your brother is older. Oh. Okay. 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 You know, sometimes it's it's like uh, it happens in everybody's house. So it happens in everybody. I have a younger brother too, and um, he gets called a lot. Hey, go do this. Hey, go do that. Hey, go do this. Hey, go do that. Yes, he does. And remember, there was a time when you were younger than your brother, and your brother was called on a lot more than you. So it's I think it's it's a it's a phase. It, it happens. Don't worry, it will pass. <laughs> There was a time they were calling on your brother every time. Maybe you don't, you, the thing is you don't remember, but they were calling on your brother every time. Go do this. Go do that. Help me with this. Bring that here. Bring that there. Take that there. Yes. And now it's your turn. So just do it gracefully and graciously and gloriously. You're a glorious child. God will give you the strength. Eh? <laughs> God will give you the strength. So, yes. Thank you so much for understanding. So, guys, yes, God asks us to, um, forgive 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 okay um okay we can see some other verses of verse of scripture there we have luke 22 i mean luke 23 33 to 34 we have um luke chapter 15 verse 11 to 32 that luke chapter 15 11 to 32 is the story of the prodigal son do we know the story yes. do we remember the story yes okay Okay, I want to ask her some question. How did the son sin against his father? Mm -hmm. um, we are supposed to read. We are supposed to read it, but there's not time. There's not. There's not enough. There's not enough time. So I'm just going to ask a question. Since you say you remember the story, all right, Sarah. How did the son sin against his father? That's no 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 is that's that's not the story that's another story that's another story can somebody help me with the story of the prodigal son treasure peculiar I'm calling on you next treasure yes how did the son sin against his father the prodigal son Beautiful. Mommy, 
Beautiful. Food. Yeah. Beautiful. God, God bless you, darling. Thank you. Yeah. Peculia. Do you remember the story of the prodigal son? Oh, I think our network is bad. I hope it's not mine. Okay, beautiful. So, how... Okay, awesome. I want to ask, Do you remember the story of the prodigal son? Okay. I want to ask a question. How did... How did the father know his son was sorry about what he did? Why, why, why is your mic muting? Oh my. Uh, because what? Uh, no, 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 no. The, Mm, okay, not quite where I'm going. Thank you for that answer. Um, who else wants to give it a try? How did the father know that the son was sorry about what he did? Giovanni. <laughs> While you are thinking about it, Emmanuel, yes? Lovely, lovely, lovely. Dara, why, why did the father, how did the father know that his son was sorry about what he did? Yeah. Oh, that's the answer I was searching for. Because he came back. He came back. He came back. Yes, he came back. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, guys. All right, so was the son expecting to be forgiven? Was he expecting that? Okay, well, I'm going to go back to my father. I'm going to tell him. Father, forgive me. I spent all I had. I mean, please just forgive me. I mean, <sighs> blessing. <laughs> okay, he wasn't expecting he was going to be forgiving. Who else? Ruth, yes. Ruth, yes. I want to hear from you. Was the son, the prodigal son? Was he expecting yeah. to be forgiven? You know, he went back to his father. Was he expecting that he was going to be forgiven? God bless you for that answer. Thank you so much. Two of you that answered, no, God bless you. He wasn't expecting. It was like, the worst that could happen was his father was not going to forgive him. And he would just tell his father, and he would just tell his father what? His what? No, no, not quite, not quite. Who else wants to give it a try? Dara, you want to say something? He wasn't expecting that his father would forgive him. So he said if his father doesn't forgive him, he would just become one of his father's servants. Yes. He would just become one of his father's servants. And hey, I would just at least... My father used to feed the servants every day. Maybe they eat three times a day. I mean, the servant eats like maybe twice a day. I mean, it's better off than what I'm going through. I'm passing through here. It's better off. It's better off. All right. So, um, so in this story, you know, it's Jesus that told this story, the story of the prodigal son of how a boy asked his father for his inheritance, daddy. I want my inheritance. I, I, I'm, I'm okay. I'm, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm done living with you. I'm a big boy now. I want to go. I want give me my my the portion of my inheritance. I, I want to go. I want to go away. So his father said, "Why? Why?" He said, "No, no, no. Please don't tell me. Don't ask me any questions. I don't want to. I don't want to. I, I just feel it's time for me to leave, and I want to go. Give me my inheritance." I said, his father said, "Okay." And then he left with the inheritance and, um, you know, he, he squandered it, he spent it anyhow, he finished it. And then the people were, came around him and they were spending with him. And then, you know, when he didn't have anything left, when he didn't have anything left, he had to go and work on the farm 
and then he was feeding pigs you know he went he went to another country he went not in his where his father was he went away and you know 